I said this before and I am going to say this again, my gorgeous Virgo, listen to me very, very carefully, please. Never ever underestimate your ability to make dreams come true, okay? Never ever underestimate your ability to make your dreams come true. There is something absolutely mind-blowing going to take place. There is something absolutely mind-blowing going to happen. My gorgeous Vergolini, right at the beginning of this week, you will be very, very happy. There were so many ideas you've had. There were so many realizations you've had. And I mean lately, especially, you've had so many ideas and so many realizations. They've all seemed to be like completely different. But what are you going to realize right now, this week, that all these realizations and all these ideas which you've had are pointing to the same thing, are pointing to the same thing. You're not going to be able to move on with your life until you realize that something is becoming really, really urgent when it comes to the particular step and when it comes to this particular move you're going to need to make. For this, you are going to need to be 1 million percent like strong, confident, and on top of that, honest with yourself, my gorgeous Virgolini, honest with yourself. What am I talking about right now? You need to understand that by the end of this week, it is going to be absolutely obvious. You are going to make a big jump, okay, from one point to another. And how are things going to happen is uh, right at the beginning of this week, you are going to have an important news, an important message. This in itself is about to change your world forever. This important news and message has got so many elements in, like it's not only about something which you have been worrying about for the last two or three months quite a lot, it's not only when it comes to this problem you've been worrying about my gorgeous Vergolini, you know, but it's also this message it's going to uh, make you feel really happy because it's to do, it's not only what you were worrying about, but it's also to do with your finances. Your financial situation is going to start looking up and you can be like maybe a millionaire or even a billionaire, do you know what I mean? But still, after this point, things are going to start going onwards for you, only up, not only. This message, news, information is going to make you aware of this specific personal, very personal issue, very personal problem is coming to an end. It's not only about that, but it's about this material gain as well. So it's telling me that maybe certain things and certain problems in your life happened maybe because it had to do something with finances or maybe the financial situation didn't allow you to do certain things and then one thing turned into another and then so on, you know, and it went for a while like that. So you are at the same time going to snap out of this, which is ever so important. The sooner you snap out of this, the more you are going to come out of your comfort zone as well. I mean, pay attention what's going to happen at around that time. Now, suddenly you're going to have this idea which you like kind of forgot about. There was some kind of idea that you had like years ago, like honestly, like, oh my God, my gorgeous Fergolini, where are you going, my darling? There was a, some kind of idea that you are suddenly also going to be reminded of and you forgot about that idea. Some kind of idea which you've had like a few years ago and now you're just going to be reminded of that idea at around this time as well. And even more so, you're going to start becoming so passionate about that idea. You know, it's just something that really it's going to be so random. Probably one of the most random moments of your entire life. And it's not only that you're going to be reminded of this old idea which you had like quite a few years ago but at the same time you know uh, something very interesting it's going to happen two or three days later after that moment in time where you are going to discover something really specific through somebody who's very close to you like your friend or a family member you will discover something really specific you will want to kind of learn more about you will want to find out more about and and then suddenly you know it's all going to start making sense it's all 
you're gonna start making sense, my gorgeous Virgolini, and you will see exactly what I mean. It's again one of the situations where one thing is gonna lead into another and it's all going to start making sense, okay? So first of all, you're gonna be reminded of this idea, but then again, you're suddenly going to be reminded of this idea, but then again, you know, it's just basically, uh, you will see that there is a very specific reason that you've been reminded of this idea as well, because it's just something that you're not going to be able to stop thinking about whatsoever, and that in itself, it's going to bring you to, the, to, to, to this such an interesting point of your life, where, you know, something is going to be brought to the surface, and you are going to, like, kind of need to make a like really important decision as well and you know especially when it comes to this important decision let me tell you in like about one month's time in like about one month's time you are gonna be like kind of pressurized to make an important decision like really really important decision this is the bottom line with that particular idea which you're suddenly going to remember there you go so for example that particular idea which you're gonna suddenly remember which you had like a years like years ago you are are suddenly going to remember that idea, my gorgeous Virgolini. What you need to understand is that in like about, so you're going to take think the way things are going to happen and unfold, you will somehow understand and you will know how important this is going to be for you, but you're not going to be able to stop thinking about this idea. Do you understand? And in like about months and a half, I would say, like about months, months and a half to two months time, you are uh, going to uh, feel uh, uh, really pressurized to make a certain choice to make a certain decision and this is when this idea is going to like kind of take over uh, so I know this all sounds weird and crazy but in between now and in between uh, when kind of like in between now and in between, you know, like two months time when you're pressurized to make some kind of decision this this time in between you have no idea where this idea it's actually going to take you and how this idea is going to unfold and how this idea is slowly but surely going to take over this stage of your life. There is something remarkable that you are going to find out about yourself through this idea. There is something mind-blowing that you are going to find out about yourself when it comes to this idea. This idea is needed for you to grow. This idea is needed for you to evolve. This idea is needed for you to not only spiritually, but in so many different ways as well to transform your life. Okay? So there is a very, very specific reason that you are like remembering suddenly this idea and on top of all that becoming so ridiculously passionate about it as well because in like about one or two months time when you feel so pressurized and you will know what this is you will feel so pressurized to make a certain decision you will see or remember oh my god i had this idea and this idea went from here to that from that to that and now this idea became so big and it evolved itself into something so important that you're going to use this in order to make one of the in order to make such a cru crucial decision and you will see exactly what I mean and if you didn't take this idea seriously you wouldn't be able to start such a beautiful stage of your life and also my gorgeous Vergolini going back to the beginning of this week so you are going to be very very happy because you know now what I wanted to say to you, it's not only about this materialistic material gain, but also at the same time, this huge issue and problem, personal problem, it's going to come to an end. You know that you are instantly going to become so creative about what exactly kind of brought this uh, money, like or, or, or what made or what made your financial situation better. You know, you're going to become very creative about it which is absolutely brilliant and you're also going to feel so proud of yourself as well you are going to realize that you are really responsible for something really specific here you are responsible for something really specific here as well there is a, some kind of responsibility right now that you're going to need to deal with okay something that you are instantly going to realize oh my god i'm responsible to do this now i'm responsible to do that 
and to do that now, to do this now. So there, there are certain responsibility that are gonna come up, you know, that you really need to kind of like take very, very seriously. And when it comes to these responsibilities, now suddenly that they are gonna come up, you know, to the surface. You need to understand that I do know that you, Oh, it's more about maybe you finishing something, maybe you finishing something, maybe finishing certain things to an end. So you can't do this without bringing certain things to an end. There you go. This is exactly what you're going to need to do. Because not that long after that moment in time, not that long after that moment in time, you need to understand that you will realize, you know, that something has come to an end and something the certain stage of your life is coming to an end like seriously but you are gonna feel happy because this is exactly what you were waiting for you were waiting for the certain stage of your life to come to an end and then once that stage come to an end then you really kind of are gonna finally uh, you know be able to do something about the decisions that you've made such a long time ago so it's not only about endings that are going to lead to new beginnings my gorgeous Vergolini but you know it's all about you feeling the need to release situations and people you know that are holding you back right now because you are going through the personal transformation you need to through this spiritual transformation you need to understand this and even more so there is going to be such an interesting sign oh my god like really bizarre sign and 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 i know at the time when you have this sign at around the beginning of this week i do know that it's gonna have such an element of this spookiness element of something strange element of something weird something is gonna scare you <laughs> something is gonna terrify you something is gonna petrify you do you know no don't get me wrong i'm not being dark lala but it's like even if you are like the most uh uh, uh experienced psychic or or even if you are the most experienced, like medium person, medium, you know, you you will still, uh, you know, get like kind of scared a little bit, you know, when this happens. So there is going to be like a very kind of strange situation at around the beginning of this week. And you are going to feel like somebody is around you, you know, somebody is with you. Uh, but then again, at the same time, it's going to be like a little bit scary, but it's just on another note, you are going to feel more curious than anything because at around that time when you feel somebody around you, this is most likely going to happen when you're by yourself at home in the middle of the night or you're somewhere by yourself at night, you know, and you are going to have this, first of all, this feeling like somebody's around you. But because you will be able to kind of feel who exactly this is, you're going to be more curious than anything else. So it's going to be like half of you, it's going to be like really kind of, oh my God, scary experience. It is. It's going to be very spooky. Something is going to happen really strange. But then on another hand, half of you, it's going to be like really scared. But then half of you, it's going to be really kind of like you're really curious as well. Uh, some kind of curiosity is going to take over purely because you will be able to to connect this spirit you know to somebody who used to be in your life something is going to somehow remind you of somebody who used to be in your life somebody who was a really nice person and somebody who's no longer here you know somebody who's here in spirit now but no longer with their body you see what i mean somebody who died and 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 that in itself it's kind of going to really surprise you but somehow Listen to me very carefully. I know that this is going to sound bizarre again, but at the moment in time when you become aware of some kind of entity or some kind of spirit around you, the reason why I said uh, that you're going to feel a little bit scared and petrified, it's because something is going to happen and you will know that something is around you. But you must not be scared whatsoever. This in itself is to do with a very, very good and very kind of powerful omen as well, because you you will know exactly which adjustment do you need to make 
you will know exactly which adjustment do you need to make because right before that happens there is going to be a really really serious discussion in between you and somebody else and things are going to like kind of get heated up and things are going to become really passionate you will be very passionate about something and 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 it's going to be like a some kind of a debate or some kind of a heated discussion about you making some kind of a adjustment or you're doing something and this in itself it's really kind of going to happen right after that this in itself you're also clearly going to understand that you know you will clearly be able to tell that you know this is your sign and clear indication that you need to make that particular adjustment as soon as you possibly can and the fact that you're going to have like a some kind of maybe disagreement argument or a heated discussion with some somebody it doesn't it's not about that other person it's not about what that other person is going to say but it's more about maybe that other person responding to what you are saying in a way uh, you don't want them to respond to you and maybe you're gonna be a little bit frustrated so it's not good it's not about that person being bad or anything like that I just need you to understand how important is going to be for you to make that particular adjustment and this in itself it's actually going to be a rather fortunate omen because now uh, when you make that adjustment and you are going to you will know exactly what do you need to do adjustment in your life you will know exactly what do you need to do and you are gonna have this mind-blowing great sense of urgency you're gonna surprise yourself because for the first time in your life you will do you will make this adjustment and you're gonna find it mind-blowing mind-blowing how easy all this was how easy peasy all this was my gorgeous Virgolini and you were worrying about this adjustment for so long poof now gone disappeared and it was something that was bothering you for absolute absolute ages so this is this very fortunate and powerful omen that you are going to have okay because it's not only that it's not only that but as soon as you make this adjustment like about a couple of days after that moment in time you are really going to have a such something it's gonna happen something is gonna happen and how I can describe this this in itself it's gonna surprise you and it's gonna be like really kind of amazing experience very meaningful experience amazing experience where you are going to become aware of like uh, when it comes to this a, a meaningful and amazing experience you're going to become aware of this intelligent very very intelligent choice very intelligent choice for you very very intelligent choice that's how i can describe this okay because there's going to be so many elements connected to this very intelligent choice and all i can say to you this week is so spiritual you must not like oh just ignore this whatsoever only because as soon as you become aware of this intelligent choice there is still something not gonna be right in your mind you're just kind of gonna find out something you're gonna be become aware of something some kind of intelligent choice for you indeed but you will it's not every everything it's not gonna be like crystal clear to you and you know and then later on you are somehow gonna start thinking about your past about your memories and you're gonna realize when it comes to that intelligent choice, I know it's going to sound weird, but reflections on the past are going to bring you an insight because of your past. Okay, so when you suddenly start thinking about certain memories, certain past, you know, all this is like kind of preparing you to realize something really specific. Just remember, reflections on the past are going to bring you an insight uh, how to overcome some kind of obstacle when it comes to this intelligent choice. And this in itself is going to lead towards you understanding clearly that you are going to need to have an important, important negotiation. Very very important negotiation and this in itself is gonna work out to be very successful for you it's not only an important negotiation but also it's actually going to be ridiculously successful negotiation as well so you've got absolutely nothing whatsoever my gorgeous Virgolini to worry about yes there is the, the moment in time you become aware of the fact that you need to make a certain trip certain journey 
The moment in time you become aware of the fact that you need to make a certain trip or a certain journey, my gorgeous Pergolini, you need to understand that that moment in time, the process of change, and when it comes to this, it's already starting. The process of change, it's already going to start the moment in time you become aware of the fact that you need to make a, some kind of a trip or some kind of a journey somewhere. This is like so important because wherever you go to this trip or journey, whenever you go to this trip or journey, you will uh, realize something really crazy will happen and you will realize that, oh my God, that there is a very, very big change. <laughs> like, I know I'm talking about changes all the time, but you will realize that there is a massive change going to happen. The massive change is going to be imminent and it's going to be quicker and sooner than you can possibly, possibly imagine. Like, oh my God. And here, my gorgeous Svergolini, you are going to become so confident about your success. Like, nothing is going to stop you ever again. Okay? And also, listen to me very carefully, my gorgeous Fergolini, when it comes to the actual beginning of the, from the beginning of the week towards the midweek, what I need you to understand is that you are going to become aware of some social invitations. You're going to become aware of some social invitations or events. Listen to me very carefully. At, from the beginning of this week, in uh, uh, towards the midweek, you will become aware of some social invitations and or events, for example. And now this in itself is like something is going to be putting you off. Something is going to be putting you off. And I think in your mind, you're going to be like, oh, I can't be bothered. I don't have time, blah, blah, blah. Oh my God, you need to rise above it. By you rising above it, my darling, you're also going to rise way above the darkness. Okay, listen to me very carefully. The moment in time you become aware of social invitations and events, you need to understand that you are going to become aware of the certain news of exciting opportunities that are going to make you ecstatic, enthusiastic, like, like, and very creative and very impatient. So it's to do with something which is going to blow you away, but it's to do with something that you did not expect whatsoever. So this is the time of your life which is really going to surprise you because you felt so, oh, I can't be bothered to go there to do this. But then, oh my God, you're going to be in one of those situations where you're going to realize, my gorgeous Vergolini, oh my God, you're going to be talking to somebody like, can you imagine if I didn't go? Can you imagine if I didn't go to this invitation, to this uh, social event or whatever it's going to be? Can you imagine? I can see you talking to somebody else. Oh my God, I wouldn't be able to do this. I wouldn't be able to do that. So please listen to me very carefully. Sometimes, sometimes, sometimes in this life, we really don't want to do certain things. You know, we really don't want to go somewhere. We don't want to be surrounded by the specific people. And sometimes we can feel a little bit sensitive, you know. And, and, and all this can contribute towards us thinking really negatively about certain aspects of our lives that we should be running towards. <laughs> and this is how you're going to feel because the end result is going to be mind-blowing. You would never find out about these like, kind of exciting opportunities, you know, which are going to make you feel ecstatic, enthusiastic, optimistic, creative, and on top of that, impatient, okay? Because you are going to be able to kind of do what makes you feel passionate, but you're also going to allow your creativity to go on the next level. Like, oh my God, this is important. This is important. And also, on another hand, this is my gorgeous Vergolini going to be also ridiculous ridiculously important when it comes to you uh, reconnecting with the people who think like you because this is uh, like really going to lead towards you kind of having this unity with them. Um 
spiritual and minded co community and the people who think like you as well it doesn't have to be necessarily spiritually minded but it's just the people who are like you and people who you're gonna feel com comfortable about whether this is to do with their spirituality or who they actually are however you are gonna be reconnected or connected with the right people you know who are gonna make your life so much more color colorful and so much more interesting we are at the end of the day really social beings you know we can be by ourselves we can be loners as much as we can as much as we like but we are social creatures we we do we have this need to be around people you know but especially when they're good people optimistic people and people who makes us feel good about ourselves my god it's so important in this life and also my gorgeous Vergolini ate around the midweek you know listen to me very carefully you're gonna realize this unhealthy attachment it's about this unhealthy attachment and something is keep on making you feel really insecure something is keep on kind of kind of making you feel really insecure my gorgeous Vergolini and and and, and I, I you will have a really powerful vibes when it comes to what this is at around the midweek you will know what is making you really insecure and this particular thing that makes that's making you feel really insecure it's also making you like a little bit isolated as as well do you know what I mean? It's giving you way too many like hermit modes, you know, if I can call them like that. And so it's something which you have been aware of for a while. It's an unhealthy attachment and it's making you feel insecure. The reason why it's making you feel insecure is because it's messing up with your energy. Okay, and that in itself is your sign that, you know, you need to really kind of do something about it immediately. You need to do something about it immediately because you are uh, going to be again in this universal flow. You're going to benefit from it. What is this universal flow? Well, it depends on the specific energy. The energy of April is mind-blowing. There you go. That's your universal flow uh, energy here. The energy of April. It's all about a new beginning, new start. It's April. It's when the new year is meant to be. The new year, it's not meant to be like on the first of um, January, the biggest rubbish ever. The new year, it's not meant to be on the first of January. The new year is meant to be on the first of April, but this creatures outside who are controlling everything on purpose they've just decided to change all the months so we can't really connect with the nature and we can't co connect with the energy you know and this is this is what the whole point is of all that you see that the, the new year is meant to be on the first of april by connecting to the energy at the specific time of the year of the months Oh my God, we become so powerful. We elevate ourselves like, oh my, it's, it's crazy how, the way we elevate ourselves. Okay, we penetrate specific like a spiritual energy and spiritual points within our bodies when we are doing certain things at the right time of the year. So when you're celebrating the new year, like in April, for example, you get so much out of it. So for example, you, uh, start uh, uh, things fresh you start new things in April rather than January and this is why uh, you are gonna have this kind of like energy throughout the months of April not only you but everybody so that's why uh, you know your eyes are most certainly gonna be open towards what has created this unhealthy attachment and the way this is gonna happen is you're gonna feel very ridiculously free frustrated ridiculously frustrated with a certain aspect of your life and this is when you're going to find this energy of April so beneficial uh, this is when you're going to be able to realize what made this unhealthy attachment and and then you're going to realize that this is something that has made you feel maybe a little bit isolated as well but also on top of that insecure and now you're gonna do you know what it's like a basically there is a one of your friends or somebody who's really close to you and important to you and somebody who has been a consistent person in your life when it comes to them giving you news so somebody who you trust to somebody who's like a consistent person 
in your life, trustworthy, and somebody who tells you things every now and then that you can 100% trust. There is a very positive uh, 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 news that that person is actually going to tell you. And based on that news, you really are going to kind of, this is really going to be the last little thing, which is going to make you aware of the fact that now you're unrestricted. You need to do something about it now because you are in this universal flow. Just remember the flow of April, the new beginning, new start, every single time, and new beginning, new start, you know, it's fantastic for the new beginning, new starts, but also it's brilliant when it comes to coming out of a comfort zone and seeing things in a different light and knowing what to do about them as well. You know, we just benefit from having a sharp mind as well on top of coming, uh, on top of us coming out of our comfort zone as well. You are gonna, you know, this is brilliant. So you are going to do something about this unhealthy uh, attachment, you know, something that has been kind of creating so much of a negative energy in your life. And like about three days later, you are going to become aware of like a variety of options, which are going to be the direct result already of you doing something like when it comes to this negative attachment and the negative attachment, you know, it's, it's like all about you identifying it and, and, and just like kind of making Making a certain decision that all you need all you need to do and you need to take that decision very very seriously and a few days later already you will become aware of a variety of options that are gonna become so delicious to you at this stage of your life my gorgeous Fergolini because by then you're also gonna become fully aware of a couple of other things you didn't know and this in itself is gonna make you aware of the fact that you know when it comes to this variety of options that you're gonna become aware of you know, you need to understand that you have to be very realistic here as much as you possibly can. And at the same time, when you become aware of this variety of options, you also need to understand not only to be realistic, but also to understand that you need to stick to the plan as well. You need to stick to the plan, stick to the plan. Okay, that's all you need to do. This is going to lead towards victory, achievement and huge success. So I'm talking about a clear progress here and well-deserved deserved recognition uh, you are really this this stage it's over the next two or three months this is going to really help you to gain in, an insight and to reevaluate certain things in your life and that in itself it's also like kind of give you such an interesting new idea as well when it comes to that particular plan that I was telling you that you need to stick to very important indeed you're gonna feel like you're ready to go and that in itself it's really kind of at the same time you're choosing to move forward with your life where you will know this is going to bring steady progress it's a hard work but you just need to do this as soon as you possibly can and also my gorgeous Vergolini by the time you get to the last part of this week uh, uh, what else I was going to say do you know what uh, it's, it's like a basically something at, at the end of the week, it, it, something is going to give you such a beautiful vibes again, uh, something is going to inspire you beautifully, something is going to inspire you at the end of the week, my God, so beautiful. And also at the end of the week, you're going to realize that you've changed and you're going to realize that you start, you started to come out of yourself. You're going to realize that you started doing things you didn't do for a long time. You're going to realize you, you've done a couple of things that you wanted to do for absolute ages. But the bottom line is you're going to feel really pleased with yourself because you are going to understand that something changed and you are changing. And on top of all that, something is really going to inspire you. My God, you're going to see something and it's going to inspire you in a such a way where you are going to feel like you're ready for something new. And that in itself, it's going to make you aware of a difficult choice that you're going to need to make. But then again, when it comes to this difficult choice, what is going to mean to you really a lot here is that you are going to be loved and supported by your family and by the loved ones when it comes to this difficult choice. So that in itself, it's going to put you in a good mood and it's going to mean to you so much it's going to mean to you so much people because by you making that difficult choice you know at the same time 
you know, uh, 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 th 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 this is going to be brilliant for you. Uh, by you making that difficult choice, uh, this is also going to be like, this is al also bringing like the beginning of this adventure into your life, my gorgeous Vergolinic, you know, because uh, just remember, you're going to feel extremely enthusiastic. Uh, just remember, you're gonna, you, you, you were so inspired in the first place. You were so inspired to do this and, and you were ready for something new uh, so that means that uh, as soon as you make that difficult choice difficult choice this is also going to be like a beginning of an adventure here all i can say to you that it's almost immediately after that moment in time as soon as you make that difficult choice you are going to have a significant life experience that is going to require changes to be made and this in itself means that my gorgeous vergolini you are going to have a very powerful and unexpected revelation as well and that uh, in itself is going to be so important for you at this stage of your life because you're going to break free and you're going to release all belief system you're going to re release all belief system you have no idea you have no idea how much your life is going to change after that and how quick your life is actually going to change after that as well one more thing i was going to say my gorgeous vergolini at around the end of this week listen um there are gonna be some sudden and unexpected changes when it comes to all this, all right? There are gonna be some sudden and unexpected changes. You're gonna need to review your options very carefully. Listen, there are gonna be some sudden and unexpected changes at around the end of the week. You need to review your options very carefully uh, because uh, I think you're going to feel a little bit pressurized to, 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 to make certain decisions or something like that. But don't, don't listen to me very carefully because this is very important. The moment in time you become aware of a sudden and unexpected changes where you need to review your options very carefully. That moment in time, you're also going to feel pressurized to uh, like respond to something really quickly. No, baby, no. You need to go and chill out. You need to go relax, either meditate or either wait one day because when you wait one day you sleep you have an astral projections you tap into all sorts of dimensions you get all sorts of answers sorry all sorts of all sorts of answers that you don't necessarily remember but the way that we identify this in the morning is we just feel very strongly about the answer we want to give about the option we want to go for you say, so we don't necessarily remember our astral projections, but we remember exactly. But when we wake up in the morning, we just feel really fresh and we know suddenly which option to go for. And that's not always uh, uh, the same option which we decided to go like straight away initially. You see, it's not, always, it's not the same always. You see what I mean? So this is why to wait one day, sleep, and then you will see, you will feel very certain about how you're gonna kind of respond to this or just meditate, meditate, because an insight is going to come to you through the actual meditation, okay? So it's either go and sleep, wake up, and you will see the uh, response is gonna be different to what you originally thought, or just have a meditation and an insight is gonna come to you through that way. Okay, my gorgeous Vergolini, thank you ever so much for watching my videos. I'm sending you brightest blessings, lots of love, healing, peace, and light to every single one of you. Sasha Bonas in Psychic Medium. Love you. Bye.